Tech Guys to Steven's DIY Auto Repair. Today, I have the perfect DIY tool for you. Check it out. Look at that. So what is this you might add? Well, this is gonna help you to check your lights and stuff in your vehicle by yourself. Now, you might be asking me, how is that gonna help me check lights and stuff in my car? Well, I'll show you. But before I show you, let me just give you a little rundown on this. So this is a Texton, part number 393. And it looks like a cock, cocking gun. And basically, it, that's um, where it originated from. So you press this, pull down here, and then you squeeze the trigger and it pulls it back up. And then this is for your steering wheel. This connects to the steering wheel. So basically what this is, is this will allow you to like depress the brakes so that you can go to the back and check to make sure your brake lights are working. Pretty cool, huh? Or if your car is safely jacked up and um, you take all safety precautions, you could even use this to um, put specific RPM on your vehicle while you check uh, a component in your car. Um, so it's pretty cool. I, th I think it's really neat, guys. And um, it's pretty sturdy. So I've tried it already. I was a little concerned, like, oh, I don't know if that's gonna be able to depress a, a brake pedal, but it actually does. It works pretty cool. So let me show you how it works. All right, guys. So we're gonna take the tool. You're gonna depress the brake with your foot, put the tip on it, and then you're gonna squeeze the trigger and come right there. Actually, I did a little too much. So there you go. Let me move out of the way so you guys can get a better look. Check it out, guys. So your brake pedal's depressed and it's resting right here on your steering wheel and it's got this nice little rubber thing to protect your steering wheel if you have a nice one. So now let's go to the back. And look at that, guys. Now you can see your brake lights. And you only need one person so now you can check your brake lights on your own I think that is a pretty cool tool guys so now you don't have to struggle to um, have a second person or to try to back up at night and check to see if they're working you could do it all by yourself with that handy little tool so obviously you can use that to check other components um, when you need to be out of the car and you need the, pe the either the brake pedal or the gas pedal depressed. Okay guys, so to undo it, just press that little release and push down and it comes right out. Okay guys, so this is a pretty cool tool. Pretty good construction uh, and very simple. It's got a little rubber stopper here to help uh, get a good grip on the pedals. It's got a nice little strong um, hook here for your steering wheel. And it's got a nice little rubber rubberized grip on it. So it won't scratch up your steering wheel if you have a plastic or leather or whatever. Um, so overall guys, pretty cool little tool. So I got this on Amazon for around $30, $35. I'll go ahead and put a link to this in the description below so you guys can pick you one of these bad boys up. So there you have it, guys. I hope this was a neat little DIY tool for you, um, something you might want to consider to help you at home when you're by yourself and don't have an extra pair of hands or feet, I guess, in this case. Okay, guys, so I hope you liked this video. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. Please subscribe to my channel. If you would like to be notified when I put out another video, make sure to hit that bell notification. And if you have any comments, questions, or concerns about this tool or any videos that you've seen on my channel or about anything else you would like, go ahead and put that in the comment section below. So until next time, guys, have a good one.